Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in SketchUp 2021 for beginners. I am architect Sonu Rai from Glad Studio and in this today video tutorial I am going to give you brief introduction about scale and offset command in SketchUp. So I am going to start with scale command. So if you will go to your uh, toolbar set here you can see this is the scale and shortcut command in S. So if you will type S on your keyboard you will see this scale command here so i will tell you how you can scale objects in sketchup so i am going to start with this 2d rectangle so i am going to first take the measurement of this rectangle so i am going to select this dimension here and i am going to take the length and width so this is 10 feet width and i am going to take the length which is 20 feet so I want to scale so you can do uh, with the measure tool also here tape measure tool and scale also so first I will tell you how you can do with tape measure tool so suppose I am going to take the measurement of this so I am going to take from this end to this end which is 20 feet and now I am going to reduce the scale size so now I want 10 feet length so I am going to type 10 feet enter and now it will ask do you want to resize the model note that component within the models that was loaded from external files will not be resized so external file will not resize but you can rescale this this uh, sketchup model so i'm going to click yes and now you can see this is rescale if you will take measurement here you can see this is 10 feet already and this is 5 feet so now i am going to control z now i will do a scaling with the help of scale command so i am going to select uh, this scale command and now it will ask click the items or object you want to scale so i am going to select this you can select this of uh, rectangle here this is 2d and you will see this kind of points here in a scale so you can uh, drag any of them and you can scale if you drag to corner it will scale length and width and if you uh, select this width only it will scale width only and it will select from length side it will scale length side only so uh, now i am going to show you some scaling here and i am going to select and i am going to first increase the scale by two times so i will just drag this corner and i will enter two times here and you can see this is 20 feet by 40 feet and now i will uh, drag to any corner i will select this corner and i will rescale to uh, 0.5 times of this rectangle just enter uh, 0 0.5 0 0.5 and you can see it is reduced to 0.5 so likewise you can use this scale command in 2d objects and if you drag to only one corner here suppose if i am dragging to this corner so it will increase only its length so i am going to uh, enter to here so you can see only length has increased but width has remained same so same applies for width also if you drag this corner it will increase width but not the length so now i, I will show you on to the 3d object so i am going to uh, select this 3d object so you click three times and your object will be selected so it will uh, click three times your object will be selected now i am going to scale this and you will see all the points here so if you drag this corner it will increase all the objects scale and if you uh, drag from this point it will increase to that direction only and if you drag to this direction it will increase the scale to that direction only. So suppose I am going to uh, increase the scale by two times. So I will drag this corner and I will type two here. So it will increase two times. 
and if you uh, drag this corner and it will uh, you, if you type 0.5 so i'm going to make half of this object so it will be half of this object so likewise you can do this and you can also use this tape measure tool like we have used in this for scaling so i'm going to select this end point to this end point and it is 11 feet 10 inch and now i am going to make it 6 feet here enter and now it will ask do you want to resize the model and click yes and you can check the length here it is 6 feet so likewise you can use scaling i am going to tell you about offset command here so offset command is similar like autocad so i am going to select this offset here and now I am going to select this rectangle and now you can drag this inwards or outwards and you can see the value here you can see the distance here and you can enter value so suppose this is a wall I want to make a wall here I will enter 9 inches for outer thickness of wall and you click enter you can see this is a offset wall here and you can after that you can use push pull tool to increase the height and you can make a wall here so uh, similarly i am going to make offset of this 3d object and i am going to select this object here first and i will explore this and i am going to select this and i will offset this and i am again going to offset this which 9 inches you can take any measurement here and again you can extrude this object like this so this is, will be used uh, mainly in our architectural modeling in SketchUp. so this was the tutorial for today's session in the next session i will come with some more interesting topics in SketchUp. so thanks for watching please like share and subscribe my channel thanks